Hey there, my no souls. How you doing today? It's Chris here, and of course, we're going to continue on with this delicious, delicious Undertale game over here. It's been super duper fun so far. I'm not going to lie. It's very interesting. Um, there's a lot of weird stuff going on right now. Uh, oh, I can't look through the telescope. It's an odd looking telescope. But it doesn't let me look through it. That's kind of weird. Ooh, look at this little marshmallow over here. What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? I guess you could probably kill a star. Kind of hard to do, though. I wonder. That'd be kind of cool. It should be a really cool super science video idea. Can you kill a star? I think you could. Are you a star? I would say that I am. I am a YouTube star. No, not really. Ooh, this guy's back here. All right. The ancient glyphs have been painted over with a list of 21 different flavors. All right. Well, fantastic. So this is another magic box. It's a box for storing punch cards. It's empty right now. All right. Give me some ice cream. I relocated my store, but there were still no customers. I'll buy something. Fortunately, I thought of a solution. Punch cards! Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can trade them for a nice cream. They're super. They're sure to get the customers to come back. Alright. Oh, I don't have any space. <sighs> sorry. I'm sorry, man. I would totally buy some nice cream, but I, I, have, I have too much stuff. Too much stuff. So let's go to the magical box over here. Let's pop some stuff in here. Sure, why not? Like, things that I'm never gonna use. The Tough Glove, I don't even know what the heck that is. Snowman piece, uh... I don't know what to do with him. The Bandage, I don't know what to do with him. The Monster Candy! I guess I'll keep that. Stick, pfft, faded ribbon, old tutu. So, I abandoned this thing. I also found this thing, so I don't know what to do with any of this stuff. I really am very, very confused. Alright, we'll buy some nice cream from this, this nice little fella over here. Sure. Absolutely. Sure. Do I actually have to, um, hold the cards, like, in my inventory? Because that would suck major ball sacks. I would never do that ever. No, sirree. So what, ooh, this is kind of an interesting little area down here. Alright, so another one of these magical... It's like we're underwater, I think. I'm not really sure. There's more flowers down here. You hear a passing conversation. So, don't you have any wishes to make? You hear a passing conversation. Hmm, just one. But, it's kind of stupid. So a little bubble area over here. I think this is supposed to be like a giant maze of some sorts. I think. So I found some... Uh-oh, is there a guy in here? Ooh, there's something in here. It's a pair of ballet shoes! Take it, yes. Okay, so we're gonna turn off all the mushrooms, because mushrooms suck. And then we're gonna move on up. So I got the, the, the skirt already, the ballet skirt, and I got the ballet shoes. If I wear those, do I get, like, something super-duper awesome? I wonder. That would be kind of cool to see. So it's still kind of mazelicious, but it's it's fairly straightforward so far. What we got to fight down here? That's a washua. It does not look the same as before, though. Uh, it looks like there should not be a duck in there. So, oh my god. Ah! Ah! Can these things hurt me? I wonder. Shoop! Shoop! Did it diddle diddle? And we got fifty toa. And my love in has increased. Mm -mm. So I was told. In the comments below, in the comments that uh, you guys always leave me down there, and I really do appreciate these, by the way, that, uh, th that, like, leveling up means literally nothing, because the enemies do more damage anyways. So, it's kind of pointless. I'm like, mm, that's, that's an interesting thing. The power to take their souls. This is the power that the humans feared. Uh-oh. Is that a giant octopus? It looks like a really giant octopus. Squid monster! It's gotta be a squid, not an octopus. Squids would be the only thing that come out of the water like that. Or... It is an octopus! Hey there! Noticed you were here. I'm Onision! You hear? Onion-san? <laughs> You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too! It's my fit favorite! Ah, even though the water is getting so shallow here, I, I have to sit down all the time, but... Eh, hey! That's okay! It beats moving to the city! 
city. I love it in a crowded aquarium. Like all my friends did. And the aquarium's full. A anyway, so even even if I wanted to, I I that that's okay though. You hear? Undyne's gonna fix everything. You hear? I'm gonna get out of here and I'm gonna live in the ocean. You hear? Uh, hey, there. That that's the end of this this room. I'll I'll, I'll see you see you around. Have have a good time. And waterfall. <laughs> I like that little octopus. He was so nice. He was the nicest little octopus I've seen in a long time. Shiren! Ooh, it almost took me down, but let's see. Let's dodge this shit, man. Alright, so it's gonna sing some music notes at me. That was like the easiest thing ever to kill. Alright. Is that supposed to be its boobs? I'd oh, whoa, whoa. What is that? Is there a slug left over? This little slug monster looking thing. Do you guys see that? The northern room hides a great treasure. Hmm. Let's go see if we can get a great treasure. Won't you play along? Only the first eight are fine. There's a piano here. Play it? So wait, we gotta figure out only the first eight are fine. Um I don't know. I don't know guys. I'm just gonna press all the buttons all at once. If you press all the buttons at once, it goes left. Interesting. Press up and right together. I think left is the most powerful. Then down, then right, then up. So if I, yeah, then right, then up. So hmm, that's interesting. Let's quit out real quick. Let's see, I wonder what the heck it could be. I, I kind of want the great treasure, but I just I don't have any idea what it's supposed to be. Haunting song echoes down the corridor. Won't you play along? Only the first eight. Are fine. So I wonder if I have to go like to the right first, like figure it out, you know. A human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. An incredible power would be needed to take the soul of a living monster. There is only one exception: the soul of a special species of monster called a boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death, if only for a few moments. A human could absorb this soul, but this has never happened. And now, it never will. Mm, Alright. Structures of its feet seem dry. I wonder why. Alright, so it's all rainy up there. I don't know, guys. This is just kind of weird. Please take one, an umbrella! Alright, so what can we do with our little baby umbrella over here? Bring it back on over here, protect him. All right. I might need to write that down. I don't think I can memorize eight things. Up, right. Oh, see, that's... Oh, man, so this is going to be tough. Sure. Nothing. Up, right... Nothing. Up, right, right. Oh, God. See, this is... Wait, what? 
Oh. Oh, I see. All right, interesting. All right, let's go back. Let's let's just uh, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna notepad this shiznit, guys, because I just I just don't feel like memorizing it. I'm really I don't know. These puzzles are kind of weird sometimes. The circle. There we go. Circle, up, right, circle, down, down, right. Okay, we got it. Let's go do it. So I was kind of confused, because I had thought I had to press and hold on the button and stuff, but then I realized you could press enter on it, and that makes so much more sense. I would have totally, totally been lost this entire time. <laughs> totally, totally, totally. All right, so... um, Oops, it got locked. Play it? Yes. We're going to go... S no, why is it locked on the right? Why, 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 why... Oh, there we go. All right. So... There we go. We got the magical treasure! I think it was just the regular treasure. All right. It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? Yes. You're carrying too many dogs. Oh, no. Um, we got to get rid of... Oh, it's the punch cards. <sighs> Stupid punch cards. Legendary artifact. Booyah! No, I just got rid of it, I thought. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I should be able to hold it. Does it take two things? Come on, legendary artifacts. Get in my belly! Too many dogs? Wait, does, do I have to drop a dog? <laughs> what? Too many dogs. You put the dog on the ground. Oh, God. The dog absorbs the artifact. What? No! No, you stupid dog! The artifact is gone. <gasps> what does it say? What does it say? Oh, this is a complete joke, guys. I can't believe that little dog took it. So I just dropped my punch cards for no reason. I thought it was... I thought it was literally just messing with me, like, you're carrying too many dogs, because this thing does that every once in a while. So here's that nice little music thing, my Bob. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I don't really like this black ink stuff. This looks pretty dang- Oh, it's a little buddy over here! No, I can't tell the brother either. Walking away. Anyway, I guess I'll go with you. Ha-ha! Let's go! All right, so he's pretty, he is pretty annoying, but he's, he's goofy. He's nice goofy, you know? He's like, oh my god, I die touch my face. I love that. Man, don't die is so cool. She beats me up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bat every night, knowing she was going to beat me up. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, so it's raining down here, too. It's just following me. Do, do Should I have brought an umbrella? I don't know. So, one time... We had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. I know, that would be absolutely amazing. I would be. I would actually be happy if, you know what, no. My, some of my friends are teachers, so I can't do that. Um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. Innocent being the key word, but I'm I'm innocent, right? Am aren't I? No, 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 no. So this is kind of cool looking. This is like, ooh, he's ran, he's running away. Oh my god, he's fast. He's so fast. How come I can't run like that? <laughs> he just had to look. We're a little dinosaur buddy over here. All right, what's next, guys? Ooh, an umbrella. Okay, let's grab the umbrella. Take an umbrella. Sure, why not? Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Yo, you want to see Undyne, right? Put up your umbrella and climb on my shoulders. Aren't you going to be able to climb with an umbrella? You oh, i got to put away. Put it back. All right. 
Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I'll always find a way to get through. Oh, you go for a little dinosaur. Oh, you go for a little dinosaur. What is he doing over there? All right, so we found a safe spot, but I think we're going to delve deeper over here. The humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly, without mercy. Without mercy. In the end, it could hardly be called war. United, the humans were too powerful, and us monsters too weak. Not a single soul was taken, and countless monsters were turned to dust. The serene sound of a distant music box fills you with determination. All right. Let's do this, isn't it? So where are we at? I don't even know anymore. I'm just in the ruins somewhere. Um, Undyne is coming to kill me. Oh, no, it's Undyne. Uh-oh. Or is it some goopy little mofos? Goop goops. Uh-oh. Oh, snap! Oh, there's Undyne! How fast can I dodge? That is the question. Whoop! Oh, stamperific! Ah, ha, ha. Uh oh. Ooh. Ah! I'm actually doing pretty good so far. So far being the key word. Alright, so. Oh. So this is kind of. Oh, it is kind of a maze. Alright, go down, go down, go down. Where am I going? Alright, I'm pretty sure. Oh, I don't have to go down. Yeah. I'm getting lost. Alright, what's this? Oh, that's a nothingness. Oh, that's more nothingness. Oh! Oh! Oh my god! That hurt so bad. Oh, they're coming for me. She's coming for me. I hope she's super hot like Samus. Like, ridiculously. Like, Samus is my babe. Oh, she's getting harder. Oh, she's getting way harder. Come on, little buddy! Run for it! Run, boys, run! Oh, man, we're getting to a big open area. Oh, there's even more of them than usual. Ah! No, another one! Ah! And it looks like we have not made it yet. Okay, at least it slowed down a little bit. There's only one there. And we've made it to the end, but it's not over yet. Do I have to run backwards? Are they going to make me run backwards? This sucks. Oh, she's going to be waiting for me, isn't she? She's gonna be waiting for me in the big area, I bet. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. There she is. I'm pretty sure it's that a she. Uh oh. There I go. There, 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 there I go. And he falls deeper and deeper underground. It sounds like he came from over here. Oh. You're falling down, haven't you? Yeah. Are you okay? Here, get up. Chris, huh? That's a nice name. My name is... Oh, I didn't get to figure it out. Too darn... Oh, whoa, whoa, what are we swimming over here? These. This is really deep stuff. What is the heck is this thing? Piles of garbage. Garbaggio. So I kind of feel bad for these. Mo oh, we get to another save point. Ooh, can we go down? Ooh, can we go up? No, not really. The waterfall here seems to flow from the ceiling of the cavern. Occasionally, a piece of trash will flow through and fall into the bottomless abyss below. Viewing this endless cycle of worthless garbage, it fills you with determination. I am. I am determined. What am I determined to do? I don't know. I guess escape. I, I suppose. Ooh, a bicycle. Honk. <laughs> that was the honk. A beat-up desktop computer. The inside is empty. Has no brand and no shows no signs of wear. A couple of freeze-dried space food bars. Sure. You got an astronaut food. Yes. It's a DVD case for an anime. Oh. Oh. Desperate claw marks. They really want to watch that thing. Seems like a regular training dummy. Do you want to beat it up? Sure. Feels good. Real good. Uh-oh. Monster? Monstor? Oh, it's... So, Uh-oh. Oh, he's angry. Arr! Fool! You think you can hurt me? I am a ghost that lives inside a dummy. My cousin needs to live inside a dummy, too. 
You used to live inside of Dummy 2 until you destroyed their home. Us ghosts can spend our whole lives looking for a proper vessel. Slowly, slowly, we grow closer to our new bodies until one day we too become a cor corporeal beings. Being able to laugh, love, and dance like any other. But you, my cousin's future, you took it all away! Despicable, despicable, despicable! Human, I hope you're not too attached to your body! Because your soul is about to get a victory! <laughs> the mad dummy blocked the way! Alright, mad dummy. We're gonna use the stick. You threw the stick away, then picked it back up. Futile! Uh oh. This is kind of weird. No, you dummies! Watch where you're aiming your magic attacks! Hey, you! Forget to say anything about magic! Oh, I sliced him. Slice and dice. Foolish, foolish, foolish! Even if you attack my vessel, you'll never hurt me. I'm still incorporeal, you dummy! Wait, is dummy a compliment? Alright, so... All right, Mad Dummy glares into a mirror. Um, no one is happy with this. He's gonna defeat me, and take my soul. He's hopping mad. Oh man. I'll just fight him. We'll see what happens. Maybe the magic will eventually kill him. Man, he's hurting me hardcore, though. He's pretty strong. Pretty strong, that's for sure. I wonder if he's just gonna die eventually. Oh, that was horrible. Horrible. Slice, slice, slice! Uh oh. Man, this guy. Oh man. Oh, he's moving really fast. He's a really mad dummy. Poo, poo, poo. Double hit! Getting caught in all over the dialogue box. Oh my goodness, the dummy. I keep hitting him, but I don't know, man. Whatever, whatever. Hit him, hit him, hit him. Got him. Oh, baby, we hit him with a couple. At least a couple. It's good enough for me. He's still a mad dummy. I don't know if I'm supposed to do something or if I'm just supposed to kill him. Pitiful, pitiful. He keeps saying different things, so I feel like I'm doing something. Futile. Got him! Mad damage. He's a mad dummy with mad damage. Alright. Foolish. Oh, yeah! Haha, <laughs> oh, now you'll see my true power relying on people that aren't garbage. Slice! Dummy bot's a magical missile! That is gonna be tough to make him hit with that. Alright. Oh, we got him! Yeah. This is also feeling being very fairly difficult though. Oh, we got with a couple. With a couple, I'll take it. Shoop de loop doop 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 Final attack! Uh oh.
Oh my goodness. No! No, no, no way! These guys are even worse than the other guys! Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? I don't need friends. I've got knives! <laughs> evil, evil knives. I'm out of knives. <laughs> but it doesn't matter. You can't hurt me and I can't hurt you! You'll be stuck fighting me forever. Forever. Oh, God. What is that? Uh, what, what, what the heck is this? Oh! Acid rain? Oh, forget it! I'm out of here. Oh, all right. Oh, he's the ghost. He's back. Sorry I interrupted you, didn't I? As soon as I came over, your friend immediately left. Oh, no. You guys look like you were having fun. Oh, wait. Didn't you attack me before? Uh, that's awkward. Sorry. Have a nice day. Well, thank you, Mr. Ghost. You're surprisingly nice. Well, I'm going to head home now. Just warning you. So you don't accidentally follow me to my house. You probably wouldn't like that. So it looks like we're to make a ghost friend today. Hello, Mr. Ghost. Oh, hey, you followed me. My house is up here. So you probably don't want to come this way. Hope that helps. All right, guys, so that's all I'm going to have for today, for Tadizzle. Next time, hopefully, we'll continue on and meet the ghost and have some fun with him. Thanks for watching. Have a super-duper delicious day. <laughs>